My name is Ken Reed. I'm a born and raised Boston comedian. I also work 40 hour per week jobs so I can do comedy full time. I'm doing New York Comedy Festival. I think I can handle New York. New York. I mean, I was up at 5 a.m. today like I always am. I was on a train in New York, walked in the rain. Oh, hey, Tom. How are you? Oh, Ken, nice you to know. finally meet you, sir. Yeah, yeah. It's very rainy. Yeah, it's very uh, ominous, actually. But it's Gotham-y and batman -y and I like that. Mm -hmm. So, are you kind of nervous about tonight? Are you I set? Don't, I don't think so. Like, uh, you know, it's a, a room's a room. Ken Reed, <laughs> yes. what do you want me to say about you? Girl, I'm going to remember it. He's really funny, great hair. The guy who played the Tin Man in The Wizard of Oz, Jack Haley, grew up in a really rough part of Boston, Mr. Spock, Julia Child. Um, and so I'm curious if that'll work outside of the city. They could Google it. Should I do a Google break? <laughs> uh, Pre-show, I'm not too, too nervous. I don't like to sort of hang around the venue and, and stew because I weirdly make myself nervous. So I usually get something to eat, walk around, see what's around the neighborhood. Take care, bud. Enjoy. Thanks. Should I fold the slice? Is that the appropriate? Folding it. I talked to a New Yorker in front of a brick wall eating a floppy New York pizza, and, and that's that's what comedy's about. All right, let's keep this comedy show a moving on. Let's bring up our next comedian, the very funny Ken Reed, everyone. Thank you. I mean, this was a much more professional operation. It was in a room that looked like the nightclub where Tracy Lords performs in Blade. There were security guards with earpieces in. There was multiple cameras. So it was a real high-class affair. I grew up in Boston, and uh, I've been watching that show Stranger Things on Netflix, and uh, it's, uh, I didn't make it. I just have a Netflix account. Um, but it reminds me so much of my childhood because, you know, I was always riding around on bikes with my friends solving mysteries, me and my friends that were just me. And, uh, and this mystery about my town that I managed to uncover is that uh, you can leave. It really reminds me why I started doing stand-up, and it's not to just sort of be comfortable doing the things that you're used to doing, but to sort of getting out there and taking some risks and being in front of unfamiliar audiences that may have a good payoff in the future. You know, you never know who's gonna see you. Thank you very much, enjoy the rest of the show. I want to come down to New York more often. It's only a couple hours away. I think this sort of reinvigorated me a little bit. I mean, I love what I do, and I would do it all day, every day. That's why I continue to do it. <laughs>